Hello guys, welcome to Perf Matrix, the core performance testing YouTube channel. Continue with the tips and tricks video series. In this video, I will provide some useful information about database bottleneck and how to find it. So let's start. Disclaimer. Performance issue or bottleneck identification is an approach which is based on several hit and trial methods. This video shows a generic approach to understand the behavior of the software system or server when there could be a bottleneck in database, especially related to the query which are not optimized. If you see the similar behavior for AUT or application under test, then database bottleneck could be one of the reasons. It is always recommended that never conclude the test result on partial analysis. So starting with the suspect part, in case you get continuous less CPU utilization of the application server and also even you increase the load gradually and do not see any significant changes in the CPU utilization graph, then it shows that the saturation occurred. The application server is not being utilized properly, even though the load is increasing as you can see in this graph. Let's see the suspect number 2 that is database server CPU graph. In case database server CPU is overutilized and shows high CPU usage, also on increasing the load you can see a growth in the CPU usage which even touches 100% in some cases, then these two suspects point out that there could be an issue with database. Look at the given DB CPU usage graph. Now let's try to find out the root cause of the error. If you are using Oracle database, then it is good to generate the AWR report for the given period in which test was executed. If you want to know how to generate AWR report, then refer to the Perf Matrix article. Its link has been given in the description section of this video. Since this is a short video, so I will directly ask you to refer to the SQL uh, ordered by the elapsed time section where you can see elapsed time taken by each query. This section you can find out in the AWR report. Ideally, elapsed time should be in milliseconds when DB is properly tuned. In this case, you can see all the queries took time in seconds and especially the top two queries which have elapsed time around 4k seconds which are root cause of the issue. As a performance tester, your task is to highlight this issue to DBA or raise a defect. When I set some recommended value to the oracle parameter in the database, then I got magical changes in the next test result. If you want to know what are those parameters, then write your email in the comment section. I will share via email. Now let's have a look at the result after tuning the DB. The CPU utilization is increased, which indicates that application server is being utilized properly. The CPU usage reached up to 29%, which was 10% before tuning was done. Now have a look at DB server CPU. You can see a drastic reduction in the CPU usage and it reduced to 6% from 63% average CPU utilization. This is only due to DB optimization. So if you can see the similar behavior in the server matrix, then check the performance of the queries and also set the correct parameter for database. That's it in this video. For more tips and tricks of performance testing and engineering, stay connected with Perfmetrics, the core performance testing YouTube channel.